1971, UNESCO launched the Man and Biosphere Program, an initiative that aimed to establish a scientific basis for the improvement of the relationship between people and the environment. The core of the program is the Biosphere Reserve. Biosphere reserves are areas comprising terrestrial, marine, and coastal ecosystems that promote solutions reconciling the conservation of biodiversity with its sustainable use. It is different from other types of protected areas and reserves since its main goal is not entirely on conservation and sustainable management but also for scientific research and monitoring. Biosphere reserves are internationally recognized, nominated by national governments, and remain under the sovereign jurisdiction of the states where they are located. There are 669 biosphere reserves in 120 countries all around the world, three of which can be found right here in the Philippines. The very first of these reserves was declared in 1977 the Puerto Galera Biosphere Reserve. Situated in Mindoro Island, about 120 kilometers south of Manila, it covers 23,200 hectares of land in northern tip of Mindoro Island. The ecosystems present in the reserves are savannas and grasslands, dipterocarp forests, mossy forests, mangrove, coral reefs, and coastal ecosystems, as well as agroforestry systems. A wide variety of endemic species are present, including the tamarau. The conservation of coral reefs has been recognized as one of the main tasks of the Biosphere Reserve since healthy coral reefs are important for the conservation of marine biodiversity, maintenance of the traditional lifestyle and culture, tourism revenues, education, and research. The second Biosphere Reserve in the Philippines was established in 1990. The Palawan Biosphere Reserve is a cluster of islands composed of a main island and smaller groups of islands around it. The 1,150,800 hectares of the Biosphere Reserve include the entire province of Palawan Island, which is the westernmost province of the Philippines. Known as the Philippines' last ecological frontier, the province of Palawan is endowed with rich natural resources and highly diverse flora and fauna found in both land and sea. Based on the IUCN classification, it has 105 out of the 475 threatened species in the Philippines. Of the 105 threatened species, 67 are endemic to the Philippines, while 42 of the 67 Philippine endemics are Palawan endemics. The newest amongst the Philippine Biosphere Reserves was established just this year. The Albay Biosphere Reserve is located at the southern end of the Luzon Island of the Philippines and covers 250,000 hectares of land. The site's high conservation value is constituted, notably, by 182 terrestrial plant species, 46 of which are endemic. Its marine and coastal ecosystems comprise 12 species of mangrove, 40 species of seaweed or macroalgae, and 10 species of seagrass. Five of the world's seven species of marine turtles are also found in Albay. Its terrestrial ecosystems are composed mainly of open grasslands and forest ecosystems, while its coastline consists of mangrove forests, urban centers, and agricultural land. It is home to three mountains including Mount Mayon, the Philippines' most active volcano which reaches 2,462 meters above sea level at its highest elevation. It has been 45 years since the Man and Biosphere program was launched and communities around the world are still reaping the benefits from the environmental, social, and economic advancements brought about by it. The program has brought great attention to the local ecological sites, creating tourist destinations that then allow for economic growth and cultural appreciation. This has lent a hand in creating more employment opportunities, enriching local culture, protecting wildlife, and creating a well-balanced environment where people can interact freely with nature and at the same time promoting its conservation and ensuring its sustainable development for next generations to come.